everybody. It's a beautiful Thursday morning, and my name is Donald Herman. And today's workout is our reps workout, which I normally do on Wednesdays afternoons at 5:30. So today's workout will have four uh, different circuits, varying exercises. Uh, what you will need for the day, hopefully you have them, is a barbell. If you don't have barbells, a pair of dumbbells will work just fine. Um, and a mat for convenience sake. Okay, and I'll give you an adjustment. I have a two-tiered box here. I'll show you in a minute. But if you don't have the steps, uh, you can do I'll give you the an alternative. Okay, but before we get started, let's get warmed up here. So 20 jumping jacks. And by the way, this workout will take just under an hour if it all goes according to plan. And I do have a tip of the day at the end. I remember to get it. So, all right, 20 jumping jacks. Ready and go. Make sure this is recording, and it is. Okay, good. All right, so we're going to do three emos each side, up and in, three per leg. You will need to play your own music for this workout, and this music and Zoom just don't seem to work together. Okay, we're going to lunge out your depth and your pace three times each side. If you've never done a reps class before, it is quite challenging, I'm not gonna lie. It's a CrossFit base work workout. It will be, I use, it's a lightweight, you wanna use lightweight. It's based on power lifting move, but it does hold full body. All right, 10 gentlemen bows. In forward arm circles. Of course, you could, as you're watching this, if it's being recorded and you're watching it, you can start and stop these workouts anytime you'd like and backwards, Tim. Okay. I'm going to do inchworms. Feet stay still. You walk your hands out. You do five push ups. Walk your hands back to your feet. Stand up. Walk back out, four push-ups, five, four, three, two, one, and go. You can always do the push-ups from your knees. Okay, so you're going to want some water handy as well and a towel. I have a towel back here. Let me show you what today's workout looks like on paper at least. So this is the first routine we're going to do. Okay, so it's going to be, now I'll show these 60 bent over rows, 50 wipers, 40 barbell thrusters, that's the tough part, 30 lunges, right leg and left leg counts as two. And then 20, either box jumps if you have a steps or what we have, box or squats. Okay, squat should say squat jumps, not box squats. All right, so that's what we're doing today, this first round. So barbell rows, you have dumbbells, you can use dumbbells. Notice the position of my back, it's not rounded. Bring it to your chest, okay? So do 60 of those. Then you're gonna take your dumbbells or your barbell. You're gonna lay on the ground. 
hold it over your head, laying down. Then you're going to bring your legs straight up, straight down. Tap your heels to the ground. Get your hips up off the ground. Yeah. Trying to bring your shins to the ball. Get your nose. I think I'm going to adjust the screen. Right. Then we have with your dumbbells or your barbells, 40 thrusters, which is a squat to an overhead press. 40 those. Then barbell, back of your neck, or dumbbells, holding up lunge. Left, right, that's two. We'll do 30 of those. Then you either going to do a box jump, which is 20 of those, or 20, just get over the box. I don't care how. 20, get over the box. That's the first circuit. First routine, should I say. Okay. We will all start together, but we probably won't finish at the same time. Some of you will beat me. Believe me. Take breaks whenever you need to. Say this periodically during the workout. Never lose form. Start to lose form, stop, and rest. Okay. So once again, 60 barbell bent over rows. Got your music on. Welcome to reps. Let's get going. Ready and go. I cannot talk and count at the same time. So I have you, that's 30. You can reverse your grip if you like. I have 10 left. Okay, set up my mat. The hardest part about this exercise is getting in and out of position. So once again, you're on your back, dumbbell or barbell straight over your head. That doesn't move. Bring your legs up and down. Get your hips up off the ground. 50 of these. Yeah, as close as I can. Bring your hips up off the ground. You're trying to touch the bar with your chins. Both feet come down, tap your heels, and go. I got 25 more. Fifteen more for me. Uh 
five more degrees. It's tight on the lower back. out of the way. Now we have one of my least favorite exercises. Thrusters is a full body move. <sighs> so we have 40 squat presses. You can do them in sets of five, sets of tens, whatever you need, whatever's comfortable for you. Just get to 40. There was a squat press. Point of emphasis, your knees, if you go down, you don't want to go out. Keep them straight in line with your body. No. Uh -uh. Yes. Halfway. Get the top. Busters and burpees are the two of the most difficult moves we have. We have burpees coming up next, the next routine. Just something to look forward to. Ah, halfway. Ten more. <sighs> I have my lovely wife in the background. Damn. She's camera shy. Okay. Ten more. All right, Woo. 40. Oh boy, shoulders. Okay, now your lunges, three options if you have available. Barbell on your back, all the dumbbells here or here, or no weight, your choice, but 30. 30 total moves. And it's very important when you lunge, not that's not a lunge. Stay tall. Go back, stay tall. Don't lean forward. Once again, do them in sets if you need to. That 
knee should not go in front of your toes. That front knee should not go beyond your feet. Seven. Okay. So now, 20, 20, just get over the box. Keep going. You haven't finished, keep going. You want to adjust the camera. I think right now I'm too dark. I think all you're doing is seeing the shadows. So, yeah, that might be better. Okay. Okay, so we no longer need a box. Okay, so here's the second routine. This one here, this is going to be challenging. Okay, so five rounds. You're going to do 10 burpees to the ground. I'll show you that in a second. 10 snatches. I'll also show you that. Okay, five back and forth, five times through. Okay, so use your mat if you want for the burpees. I have an unbalanced backyard. But anyway, jump down. It's not a push-up per se, all the way to the ground and up. That's one. Or without the without the floor, just go here. That's one. Your choice. All the way to the ground is tougher. Ten burpees. Then you're gonna pick up your bar. Actually, be on the ground. What a snatch is. Okay. Feet shoulder width apart. Hands as wide on the bar as comfortable. Just slow down. Keep the bar as close to your legs as possible. All in one move. Jump up over your head. Bring it to your chest. Go back down. Side view. Notice how close I keep the bar. Okay. Get a little hop in there. It's not a muscle up. It's not a not not a squat. To, I mean a Power clean press all the way up. That's both of these moves together use a lot of energy. So five rounds, 10 burpees, 
10 snatches. All right? This is the toughest routine of the four, in my opinion. Okay, once again, we'll start together, but we won't finish together. On your mark, get set, go. I'm going to tell you how much I hate burpees. Ugh. Ten snatches. I'd like to say it gets easier. It doesn't. Got to sneeze. Pollen blow around today for some reason. Oh, right, here we go. Don't wait for me. Notice I'm hopping. Get off the ground. All right. Woo. One round. <sighs> Four more to go. Ten. Oh boy. Don't wait for me. If you're ready for snatches, jump on it. That's so good for you. Right. What we're doing? Ten snatches. You got this. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Five. Four.
Ten herpes. Let your heart rate come back down if you need to. This is what I have to do. All right, here we go. Don't wait for me. Go. Get ready. Halfway through the routine. Right. Now we're on the downhill slide side of the mountain. Yeah. Go ahead and go, don't wait. Ten snatch. But if you lose form, rest, which is where I am right now. Okay. Wow. So we have just 20 more of each move. <laughs> Sounds so big. Feels so big. Here it is. Get that page. Right. Don't wait for me. Don't lose form either. Ten burps. I may do it with sets of fives.
Oh. I got 10 snatches. I do those with two sets of fire also. Doesn't matter how, just get it done. Oh boy. You don't realize it, but within 10 minutes of the entire workout being done, you're gonna feel great. It's just getting to that point is the hard part. Five more. Burpees to the snatch. And I believe this is the hardest part of the workout. This routine. Five more. I know the instructor's not supposed to die. Yes, but oh boy. At least I'm doing it. Hopefully that helps. See me suffering? You can suffer in pain as well. Confidence as well. Ten snatches. Hello, Ryan. Hey, bye. Don't come say hello. Come here. Come here. Yeah. Hey, Ryan. Good girl. It's my son's dog, Ryan. Female dog named after my son's best male friend. <laughs> anyway, okay. Ten. Five.
Okay, so that brew routine. So if you're waiting on me, you don't have to. You can just fast forward to the next routine. Or if you're finishing up, keep going. Get it done. So, two down, two to go. So we are here. Once again, five rounds. But there are three moves. Six reps of the push press, nine reps of hang cleans, 12 deadlift. Repeating through those for five rounds. Once again, if you have dumbbells, you can do them with dumbbells. What a push press is. Here, dip down, straight overhead. Yep, so six, push press. Then, with the barbell or dumbbells, hang. Anytime you hear the word hang with a move, that means you're starting at mid-thigh, mid to upper thigh. So the bar is mid-thigh, knees bent. All you do is pop it up. So from the side, it's not that. Once again, try to keep it as close to your body as possible, up and down, all right? Then that's nine of those, and we have 12 deadlift. I prefer a reverse grip, that's personal preference. One hand open, one hand closed, feet shoulder width apart, toes straight ahead, hands outside your feet. Eyes up, stand up, touch the ground, Stand up, side view, notice position of my back. It's not here, I'm not rounded, it's here, okay? So six push press, nine, hang clean, 12, dead lift, five times, okay? Okay, we'll start together. I'm gonna finish at different times. Already tired. Okay. All right, here we go. On your mark. Get set. Go. So I'm sticking my butt out. Like a hang, like a kettlebell move. Use a kettlebell, you do that move, the same move. Twelve deadlift. I'll show you the side view first round. Bend your knees. Don't look down, look up or straight ahead. One round. That's not exhausting, it's just I'm tired from the last routine. Little pulse check. Take a pulse, out with your thumb, with your fingers. Start in the middle of your wrist, roll towards your thumb. You'll feel a beat. 
get a clock, count how many beats you feel in six seconds. Take that number and add a zero. So if you feel 13 beats, add a zero, that means 130 beats per minute. As an example. Okay. Number two. Six push press. Well deadly. Take the back. Now, we to go. Ah, why am I doing this to myself? I live to see my grandchildren when I'm in my 90s. Six, push press. Don't wait, go. Well, dead left. Yeah. My back's a little tight. I'm going forward now, so. Nine and clean.
Jesus. All right, 12 deadlift. Knees in line, three toes. Without me. Here are six push presses, nine hang clean, 12 deadlifts, fifth round, here we go. Up dead left. With that one. Ooh, baby. So now we have one routine left. And it's for eight minutes. So we have two moves. Push-ups. Go for your knees if you have to. Do what you can. Off your knees. Then go to your knees when you need to. Three push-ups, three cleans, which is from the ground all the way to here. We did hang cleans from here just a minute ago. Same thing, but now you start at the ground. I'll show you just a second. So a clean. Whoop. There. Keep the bar close to your body. Up and down. But here's the key. Three push-ups. Three cleans. That's one round. After every round, add three reps to each move. So your second second round is going to be six push-ups, six cleans, nine push-ups, nine cleans, so forth and so forth for eight minutes. So the idea, the goal is to try to get in as many rounds as you can in the eight minutes, okay? All right, I need my clock for this one. This is the last routine. Okay, you ready? Three push-ups, three cleans. One more, get set, go. Pace yourself. Okay. 
six push-ups. Six queens. Trying to give you the minute on the minute first time. Six, six clean. One down. Seven to go. Nine. It'll start to slow down. Real soon. Nine push ups. Nine push ups. Moving. What have to? Make sure that bar stays close to your body, up and down. We're halfway. Four down, four to go. I'm to really start to slow down now. Cleaners. Even though it's lightweight, it's a full body move, it takes a lot of energy. It's just 45 pounds. Here you go, three minutes.
five more to go. Mm. I will say I've lost some conditioning during this quarantine stuff. We've got a minute and a half left. 18, I don't know where you are. This will be my last, if I can get all in. One minute to go. One minute left. We're done. I got to try to get eight more. It ain't happening. Woo. Stop. Ugh. Oh, boy. We are done. Okay. So, try to catch my breath while I give you the tip of the day. Metabolism. I've always used the analogy to describe metabolism and the effect exercise has on it. Basically, we all know what a wood stove is or fireplace. So I you have a fire stoked, it's going. What happens to that fire whew, when you add wood? Okay, when you add wood to a fire, the fire gets brighter, gets hotter. Okay? Think of exercise affects your metabolism like wood does to a fire stove. So exercise increases, makes your, makes your metabolism rise, burn more calories. Stop exercising, the longer you lay off with exercises, that fire, that stuff, that oven gets cooler. You don't burn, you're not as efficient. So exercise makes your body much more efficient. Sometimes burning calories. Beautiful thing about weightlifting. Because when you're lifting, you're actually tearing down muscle fibers. The recovery time between exercise, between workouts, your body uses calories to repair itself. That keeps your metabolism running as well. So even though you're not working out from one day to the next, if you lift the weight, you're burning, you're burning calories and your metabolism is gone. Okay? So that's it for today. Thank you for joining. Until next time, everybody stay healthy. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus.